Uh, pick three from our uh, three-pack here from Mark Mancini. We're going to be looking at this one between the Braves and Cardinals here. Uh, they got through, they got the game in last night, had some rain. Uh, they're going to uh, back here at 7.20 Eastern time. The Braves are going to come favored here, $1.45. The, the uh, Cardinals have a take back here as underdogs, a plus one, a 25 in this one. We see a total here of a nine and a half on the mound here for Atlanta. will be a Ian Anderson, who's had a really rough season this year. Again, hit, walking a lot of guys. Uh, Andre Palanta, kind of a reliever, trying to get into the, in, into the starters role. How do you see this one, Mark? Well, the Cardinals are in the midst of a road trip. They went through Philly. They're down in Atlanta now. The Braves had a rough start up in Cincinnati. They should have had a no-hitter. Charlie Morton let that loose. But I think the Braves, when they're home, they're a tough team. I know they had a stretch their last home stand where the Giants came in and the uh, Dodgers, they won four out of seven. They should have won five out of seven. They blew that game on that Sunday when Kenley Jansen gave up uh, the, the go-ahead run. But I like the Braves at home. They're resilient. They haven't missed a beat, and they're defending the flag as far as the champs go. So I'm going with Atlanta. St. Louis is in a hell of a battle with Milwaukee. Different division. But look at what the Braves have done, Tony, of late. They've chop that Mets lead down to hardly anything. Yep, they sure have. Yeah, Atlanta's a tough out here, especially at home. But again, looking at Ian Anderson, he's just been clobbered. I mean, that's the, that's the, that's the, the, the uh, fly in the ointment here for Atlanta. An ERA over five, whip of 1.52, one and a half base runners per inning. Uh, does does get the ground ball, but the walks are also the concern at eleven percent. Now Palanza one of the wild card here. Uh, Twenty three appearances, good good ERA, good whip. Not a lot of starting experience. A lot of those numbers have been put up in relief appearances. But how do you see the pitching matchups here? Well, I do. I like that. I mean, I, I think Atlanta's you know trying to find that pitching. You got Freed, you got Morton, you got some guys there. But you know what? Snickers did an excellent job of navigating through this with injuries and everything. Albies have been in and out of the lineup. Acuna, you know, look at the whole thing with Freeman. They replaced Freeman with Olsen. On the other side, the Cardinals, man, look at Arenado. Look at Goldschmidt. Look at these guys, man. They don't miss a beat. The Cardinals are resilient. This could be a preview of a National League championship. Series. Yeah, they kind of fought back here. They had, I know they got some love. Or, or, or Arenado, if you stayed up late and saw the final inning there, uh, they were knocking on the door trying to get back in this one. Uh, Mark likes the Braves, the minus 145 against the Cardinals. Even though Ian Anderson, I said, I think he's the, he's the trouble spot here for uh, Atlanta. If they lose a game, I think this might be the one. But Mark likes the Braves here, minus 145 against the Cardinals. Uh, this one will have a start time here of 720 Eastern time. All right, let's continue on here with uh, guest picks. Our guest today is Mark Mancini. Uh, you'll find him over at Mancini Sports on Twitter.